We got a great show for you tonight. I got all my friends here. We're gonna laugh and we're gonna raise some cash. You ready to get started? I saw our first comic perform in Denver recently. He killed me, so I immediately asked him to be on my show. He's not only a grand champion of Last Comic Standing, he's also living proof that you should never let a disability stop you from making bad facial hair decisions. Yes. Please welcome Josh Blue. Well, thanks, uh, thanks, Ron, and thanks to the troops. I gotta say, I've always had so much respect for the military. I've always wanted to join, uh, but unfortunately, I don't think they have a special, special forces. <laughs> yeah. If you see me in camo, we have surrendered. <laughs> I'm here to defuse the bomb. <laughs> so I want to tell you folks, I'm a very happily married man. Listen to all those happy ladies that I'm off the market, like, woo! Some poor woman took the bullet for us. Another creepy guy I don't have to fight off in the bar. I still go. Don't tell my wife. She's amazing, she's Japanese. So that, yeah, oh, you've heard of it. Yeah, we're pretty visual. Well, we're an eyeful, really. <laughs> yeah, let's just say we check a lot of boxes. <laughs> English is my wife's second language, and that has come in handy. <laughs> I mean, we have come a long way in understanding each other. Yeah. She talk them real good now. <laughs> My wife is a nurse, so we have very different jobs. Yeah, give it up for nurses, a badass. <laughs> My wife works in the ICU, so um, I don't like to ask her how her day went during dinner. <laughs> or any time, really. Uh. <laughs> I thought having a nurse in the house would make me feel more safe. Mm -mm. <laughs> I've yet to be able to injure myself bad enough for Nurse Yuko to give a <laughs> I found that if my wife and I ever go anywhere together and she's wearing her scrubs, people will come up to her like, you're a saint for taking him out. <laughs> like, I like banana bread. <laughs> I know what you're supposed to do. That's what I do. I know she loves me, too, because she goes along with it. <laughs> She's like, you want to see him do a trick? <laughs> Feed him a banana bread. <laughs> she know I hungry. <laughs> I've been over to Japan three times to visit my wife's family. Have any of you ever visited my wife's family? <laughs> I don't fit in well. <laughs> Japanese is a hard language. Like, I feel really dumb over there. Like, to the point of, uh, do you think it's too late for me to tell my wife that I don't know what her dad's name is? <laughs> I feel terrible about it. I do, I feel terrible. It's not like I don't want to know. I just haven't been able to figure it out. <laughs> I was so desperate to figure out what his name was. Last time I was there, I actually stole his mail. <laughs> that didn't help at all. 
I think I have narrowed it down, though. I'm pretty sure his name is written Line Stick Box. Line Stick Box. Anybody know how to pronounce that? You'd be doing me a solid. <laughs> Line stick box. I'll probably find out that means like current resident. <laughs> oh, good morning, current resident. Another major problem I have in Japan is meal time. Because a lot of times you eat your meals sitting on the floor at a low table. And I think that's a very beautiful cultural experience for most. <laughs> but the thing you need to know is that people with cerebral palsy, we don't fold up well. It's like trying to do origami with plywood. <laughs> the problem is the table is too low for me to put my legs underneath it, so I have to go like lengthwise with the table, <laughs> taking up five seats, just lounging in the restaurant. Her whole family's on the other side of the table. I'm just kicking it over here. Like I own the mother <laughs> Then the next big problem I have is a lot of times restaurants don't carry silverware. I don't do chopsticks. <laughs> So now, because I don't do chopsticks, not only am I the only person lounging around, but now I'm also the only person eating like this, like, oh, yeah. <laughs> this is good soup. <laughs> That broth is hot. <laughs> By the way, thanks for taking us out to dinner, line stick box. <laughs> Gonna take real good care of your daughter, yeah. <laughs> hey, thank you, and thanks to the troops, all right? <laughs>